Welcome to the Trump Breaking News Network, your daily source for up to the minute Trump news. Join us today and every day. Here's today's news. This is TBNN. Al Franken has his own history of using ugly, offensive language. By Peter Hassan. Minnesota Senator Al Franken called President Trump racist over the weekend for referring to Senator Elizabeth Warren, who claims to be part Native American, as Pocahontas. Left unmentioned, however, is Senator Franken's own history of using ugly and offensive language regarding women and minorities. While speaking at the White House Correspondents' Dinner in 1996, Franken ridiculed Gingrich with a joke about his daughter's first menstrual period, the New York Post's Deborah Oren reported at the time. The joke was so out of bounds that then Vice President Al Gore personally walked over to Gingrich's table with an apology, the Weekly Standard noted after the dinner. Adding, soon after, Gingrich encountered Franken and told him that, were Gingrich not a public figure, he'd have punched the comic out. As a writer and comic for Saturday Night Live, Franken helped craft a racist skit advertising a fake toothpaste called Tarbrush, meant to darken black people's white teeth, according to the book Saturday Night, a backstage history of Saturday Night Live by Doug Hill and Jeff Wingrad. One sketch written for Garrett was a parody commercial for a toothpaste called Tarbrush, which darkened Black's supposedly shiny white teeth, Hill and Wingrad write, adding that two Black technicians on the show reportedly walked out due to how offensive the skit was. We relied on, Morris, to bring some Blackness to the show, Franken told the authors. The Tarbrush anecdote was repeated in Ad Week in 2006, which noted that some of, Franken's crew, at SNL quit over a sketch he'd written for Garrett Morris called Tarbrush? The skit never aired. Franken is also on record making anti-gay comments. I just don't like homosexuals, he told Harvard University's student newspaper while working for SNL. If you ask me, they're all homosexuals in the pudding, a Harvard social club. Hey, I was glad when that pudding homosexual got killed in Philadelphia. Despite his own offensive past, Franken had no problem calling out President Trump for his use of the term Pocahontas to refer to Warren. If he had been in the room when Trump referred to Warren as Pocahontas, Franken said he would have responded, Mr. President, with all due respect, that's racist. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is TBNN.